Okay, guys, this is Jenny. Besides the big reaction, big, huge neck crack, she has a laundry list of symptoms. She has severe artery hardening, broken back. She has some birth trauma. She has diabetes. Lots of auto accidents in there that are pretty severe. And, oh, yeah, she came in for pain. Uh, I think you're going to want to watch this one, guys. Uh, it's pretty incredible. I'm Jenny, and I'm 66 and I work in retail at South Coast Plaza. Gotcha. Why are you here today, Jenny? My left shoulder has been bumming me out on the back and it's like kind of between the shoulder and the neck, the spine. And I don't know why. Okay, so tell us what bummed out means in a 66 year old body. Oh, because it, bummed out to these young kids won't know what that means. Yeah, that's true. They, they grew up with uh, Generation X linguistics exactly basically so is what basically it ain't surfer sick okay it's just sick you know and i don't i don't like the the pain that i'm getting yeah she's in a, she's in a world of hurt yeah. she may look like she's calm but she's in a world of hurt she's all fidgety and stuff and a little bad mood about this whole thing so we're here to gonna fix her up okay gotcha and so why don't you tell us why you have these cool little jeweler glasses on? well i was three months premature so i'm legally blind from the oxygen overexposure but better than the alternative i was in an incubator and the babies who didn't have an incubator usually had a higher mortality rate but i had a cataract fixed which took away my nearsightedness so now i see great farsighted but i need these and instead of going around with five or six glasses of various strengths, I just got these jeweler's loops clip on your glasses. I think they're great. They're from Amazon. Yeah. About six to nine dollars. Okay, so uh, also type one diabetic for how long? 37, almost 38 years. Can you show us a little device you got yeah. going on here? So she's got uh, one of these little... Insulin pump. In insulin pump, di direct readout. You need the top button pushed up. Yep, and so uh, we'll get a little closer on this in a minute. i going to show you before and after we treat her yeah. what her insulin will be. or and Not her insulin, her, uh, her yeah, blood sugar, sugar will be. Blood yep. sugar is read by Dexcom. Okay, she had a rear-end accident when she was 13. Her neck swelled up really big. She also had an 18-year-old... When she was 18, she also had a front-end collision where she hit, her wind, hit the windshield. And I went up to the windshield and... Tasted. Just totally. 56 stitches later. Yeah. And so that's a big one, guys. If you know anything about how the spine works, mm -hmm. you hit the windshield, it causes your head to do this, which uh -huh. causes a tremendous issue with the occiput and the atlas. Um, she also had a slip and fell 11 years ago and on her ass, which gave her, I guess, a compression fracture at her L5, which I'll show you on the x-rays as we go forward on that. Um, little heartburn, little dizziness, but really she's here for the back pain. shoulder. Yeah, face down, please. Face down. And she doesn't have. She has a really, really high pain tolerance, and she's going to tell us how much pain is this right now. Mm, nothing. Nothing exactly. Now I want you to see her range of motion when she looks at the ceiling. Look at the ceiling, please. See, she has really poor range of motion, and she says she has zero pain here. No pain. Gotcha. And look straight ahead. How much is your left shoulder hurt right now without moving? It's just really niggling me. It's like a, a cramping. Back okay, there. on a niggling scale of niggling one to ten. Maybe a four. Four, gotcha. It's, it's really drawing my attention. Yeah, we love to get that information on camera so that mm -hmm. people know what you're going to be like before and after. Oh, yeah. She's a little bit of a throwback to the 70s I think um, and she's gonna let us know exactly what she thinks about this after oh, we're done. oh yeah you'll oh, be ready with the yeah. bleeper <laughs> so I think this is gonna be a very honest rendition of my work you poor she's guy. never ever <laughs> she's never ever been treated by me before and so uh, we're gonna see what a real person with real feelings with real uh, expression does after I adjust her okay uh, she has a reversal um, not nearly as bad as I thought it was gonna be um, right about C5, C6. And there's some arthritis in there. Phase two, phase three, pushing phase three. And guess where I'm going? Right through that, guys. We've got a lot on these x-rays. 18 millimeter right imbalance, left TMJ and scoliosis. Here we have eight millimeter right short leg, 14 degree scoliosis, you can see that. Worn atlas, low neck reversal with arthritis in this one. And here's the biggie, severe aorta sclerosis and L5 compression fracture. How painful is this? It's not painful. Good. Come towards me, please. Ah! Ah! Oh, shit. Bleep. Oh, shit. <laughs> bleep. Bleep. Bleepity. Bleep. Should I have warned you? Yeah. That was scary. Because it also heard, like, the crack. The crack. Big time crack, huh? Oh, God. So we're going to get her this side. She's a little a little scared this time. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me have this. Mm -hmm. Even though she says she doesn't feel any pain. 
Okay, turn to the right a little bit. Ah! Oh, 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 good. oh, oh God. That did feel a little painful, but yeah, then yeah, I'm yeah. sensitive because where did my neck swell up when I was younger? Oh, of course. All along here. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Okay, we're not doing any more. We're not doing any more, okay? Woo-wee! That was some big cracks and some big reactions there. Now we're reminding Jenny not to twist her turn or she'll undo my work. Let's see how she's doing. Feels warm back there. Warm. At the back of my head. Gotcha. And otherwise, you know, I'm not noticing anything in the shoulder. But, different already, uh, huh? Yeah. A little different, okay. I'm not. I'm, we're gonna... I'm noticing it's still the same. It hasn't changed. You mean still no? There's still the pain. Still, still there. a bit of pain back there. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Recalibration time. Scoochie, scoochie to the door. Let's see how you're doing. Now this is a four out of ten a minute ago. Yeah. The tweaker, tweaker is still four yeah, out of ten. Yeah. Still kind of more three out of ten. More now, three out of so ten. So it does seem a little better, but we were gone and came back. No problem. Then. Okay. Look down the floor, please. That was no. You had no pain there before. No. Look at the ceiling to see if there's any differences here. Nope. No. Gotcha. Okay, so uh, also take a look at your um, diabetic oh, machine. Yeah. Take a look. I forgot probably, to get it It probably there. won't really show anything yet. I'm just kind of curious. Yeah. So. Uh, I can't tell if that was different. I should have taken it before and after. Yeah. What What is the, because I don't have my glasses. It says uh, 104. Okay. It is down. I was 121 when it came in the second time. Cool. Yeah. Okay, great. Yeah. So that was about... 10 minutes ago when you yeah. checked 121. Yeah. Gotcha, okay. So uh, anything else you want to share about what this first experience is? Well, if you do have type one diabetes, always bring some gummies or some sort of rapid acting sugar. You could bring uh, she already Capri knew. Sun or she something. She already knew it was gonna be yeah. a little lower. Yeah, because I had just a typical, you know, one of those spa thing massages on my back <clears> and that <throat> made me go. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Okay, say goodbye, Jenny. Yeah, yeah, bye, Jenny. <laughs> Okay, uh, this is Jenny, and uh, she came in a couple times back in May, and this is what? This is July now, so yeah. a couple months later, right? I am a bad girl. So she came in originally for left shoulder plane right under here. Yeah. Uh, how is that? Tell us how that's been. It's over actually not bothered me. Good, good, good. Um, you know, I did get a new mattress, and I also, you know, did some of the steps with the icing and the walking Perfect. for 10 minutes and things, and that helped. Good. And then what about sleep? Sleep is a lot better with the new mattress because I'm not getting woken up by the pain anymore in my shoulder. Good, 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 good. Yeah. Now we also had some right carpal tunnel, carpal tunnel something with the right hand. Yeah. I, don't, I forget what that was. What was that about? I think it was just some pain in there when I, it was carpal tunnel. And how's that doing right now? It's doing better because I've stopped trying to uh, just type one <laughs> hand and I'm hitting that microphone and dictating my text now to yeah. hell with it. But we talked about posture and how she was uh, addressing her phone because of her vision. Mm. She has to be like, this you yeah know? and so all oh, that creates a negative effect on the neck mm. and um, so anyway she's adapting to that a little better mm. uh, you were dizzy one to two times per week before a little lightheaded yeah How's that been? yeah it's actually good good, good. so I don't have too. any more dizziness perfect mm. and when I win the lottery I'm coming back all the time she likes us she yeah. likes us yeah I do okay so uh, say goodbye Alice bye Alice <laughs> good night George <laughs>